Hey guys, welcome in this bug fix video. We have a small bug. Uh, here, if we keep digging into our ground, we are going to soon fall through the terrain. And I was informed by one of you on Discord. So here we are on Discord and Pluffs, sorry if I uh, mispronounced the name, uh, has mentioned that the underground chunks aren't rendering when digging down. Okay, so what is the reason? I'm here in the terrain generator during the generation of a chunk data for a position 0, minus 100 and 0. And when we go down uh, a bit, we are going to enter two for loops that points us to our uh, chunk, uh, process chunk column. And this will calculate our noise. And later on, we are going to start using our uh, chain of responsibility handlers to handle what should be placed, what type of block should be placed there. And first we go to water, and since our y is equal to minus 100, we are not going to handle uh, the block uh, using the water layer. We are going to go next to the air layer, and of course it will not work for the same reason. The surface layer, again, the y is not equal to surface height noise. So we are going to be left with our uh, underground layer handler. And here is the bug. For most of the other layers, we uh, were always working with Y greater than surface height noise. So basically it was always zero, because we have no chunks that are higher than Y equals zero. Our chunk height is 100 and that is it. We only have chunks that are below our terrain, so with Y uh, less than zero, which is in our case Y equals minus 100. And we have always taken into account that our position is always in the chunk coordinates because y is, was equal to zero. But in our underground layer handler, there is a bug, sorry about this. I have taken it into the same uh, thinking that y is uh, also in the chunk coordinates, but it is not true. The x and z coordinates are in chunk coordinates, but y is minus 100, and chunk coordinates are from zero to chunk height. So. What we need to do is basically in all the ch handlers that are going to handle the underground chunks, we need to ensure that Y is calculated from the world position to the uh, local chunk coordinate space. And how we are going to do that? Let me stop the debugging process. And we are going to basically uh, subtract from this Y minus chunk data dot world position dot Y. Because x and z are already in local space, we do not want to convert those parameters. But if y is equal to minus 100, if we uh, subtract from it minus 100, so minus minus gives us a plus, so this will be minus 100 plus 100, this will be 0. Now, the, if this will be higher, so it will be minus 90, we are going to add to minus 90 hundred, so we are going to end up with a value 10. So again, this will be always in the chunk coordinate system. Okay, so with this change done, let's file and save all, and let's go back to Unity. Okay, let me press play, and we are going to test our system. Let's regenerate our chunks. I have generated our ch a smaller map, and I, uh, I am using the gizmos to show uh, that uh, we have here the show gizmo. So this allows us to show our chunks, so our underground chunks were created uh, and they, they, those are there, but they were set to be to have blocks of type nothing because of our bug. Right now we can simply keep on digging, and as you can see we went a bit uh, underground, and we can keep on digging in any of those sides now, and we should have those uh, chunks still working perfectly fine and we should be able to simply keep on digging in this uh, way and new chunks should be generated now we have still this uh, bug of uh, the camera clipping through our mesh but beside this our system now should work fine and as, as you can see we have now uh, gone to this chunk and if we keep on digging the next one as you can see was generated fine and we can still keep on digging and go even further and the next chunk should be generated as well because all of those blocks are now set to be of type dirt so we can keep on digging underground with no more problems okay
Thanks a lot again to Plavs for letting me know about this bug. In the next video, we are going to start working on our biomes or on adding an, uh, another biome so that we can have a sand uh, biome as well as our grass biome near each other. And I'm going to show you how you can add this and later on you can probably add more biomes to the same system. Okay, see you in the next video.